Hey everybody, happy Friday. It's Shelly, if you're wondering why I'm wearing a headset. Um, some folks are saying they're having a hard time hearing me, so I thought I'd give this a whirl, go back to the headset. Uh, this is how to create a custom tab icon for your Facebook timeline page. Now, many of you have switched over to the dark side and gone to the new timeline. I have not. I'm waiting till the absolute last minute. However, I'm going to show you how a marketing tip will help you with some of that real estate on Facebook. So let's jump over. There's not a lot of space on Facebook. Now this is my timeline. There's not a lot of space for marketing. I have not added my cover photo. I have not made this public yet. But notice these icons or tabs as Facebook calls them. Basically the photos you cannot edit. The last photo you upload is what shows up right here. However, every one of these tabs that can show these three can be edited. So for example, I created this read this, want some love, show some like on PowerPoint. And then I use the snip, I don't know if you can see this little snipping tool from Microsoft, to copy and save that as a JPEG file so that I could then upload it. So let me show you how to change this image to anything you want. First you have to drop down and so you see all of your tabs. Each one of these has a pencil. So if I want to take the Bushaka application, I can go ahead and click on this pencil. Not only can I change the image, but I can change the name. Let me show you how to do that. Clicking on the pencil, it will open a new menu. And in that particular menu, it's going to ask me, if I scroll down, if I want to, oh, come on now, Facebook. Go back up there, it's jumping around. Let's try again. Okay, so we're down here. We scroll down. It's going to say, do you want to edit that image? Right, edit settings. So you want to go to edit settings for the image that you want to customize. Notice you can give it a name, any name that you want by typing in there. But I'm going to show you how to change that tab image. All you do is click change. And it will open up another menu screen for you to go in and upload an image or take any image that you already have on your Facebook page. So that's the image that's out of the box, if you will, for this application called Bushaka. But I can go in and change that image, browse on my hard drive, and bring in any, any image that I want. Now do notice that the image is 111 by 74 pixels. Facebook will resize it and convert it, but it must be a JPEG, GIF, or PNG file. So that's how you go in and customize that image, keeping in mind that with Facebook, you have very limited real estate to work with on using your new brand timeline to market your business. So I hope this helps you. I'm going to start doing more tips on using Facebook for marketing and, of course, having custom images for your tabs is key. This is Shelly. Let me run through a couple other things real quick. Our insider group, our next one's going to be specifically focused on doing marketing with a brand page. So we're going to get into a lot of detail on that for our next Facebook insider. Actually, it's going to be on Facebook. It's going to be the insider group. And it's the first Monday of every month. If you'd like to join, just email me at sroth at shellyroth.com. Be happy to um, add you to our secret group, our, our group on Facebook, where we help each other and support each other. Coming up in Houston, March 30th, I'm on LinkedIn Now What, as well as Facebook for QR codes down in Clear Lake. Give me a shout if you want to learn any of that. Thank you so much for your attention, and have an absolutely fabulous weekend.